Yeah, this is Kaz reporting for Care Kids News. This is Otada, a part of Auckland. And this is the Tower of Otada. We filmed this last week. And we filmed the man who built it. The tower has been a mecca for the Otada kids. Can you tell us about the treehouse? The treehouse is um, um, beautiful and amazing. All the new families that moved in around this area, they'd always walk past and they'd be like, wow, that's so cool, maybe we should make one. I've always wanted a tree house, but my parents never gave me one because we've never had a tree. <laughs> Every single night it has these LED lights which would always glow up. They always look like twinkling fairies inside the sky, I guess. And everybody would come and have a look at it. Levi walks all the way out of town with his trolley because he doesn't have a car just to get the material. He's an old man that always built stuff around his house. At first, this story was going to be a tour of Levi's tower. But then everything changed. The council are here and they are demolishing the tower. So across the road, at the Bro Levi, he's getting his um, tree house taken down for some reason. Don't know why. So sad. So I was walking from the corner down that shop over there, and then I saw, um, let's say, five builders, and they and I asked them what was going on, and they said that they're taking it down that treehouse. That's very sad. I didn't think he thought that council would take it down. It took him one year to make. They're just pulling it down, I think because it's unsafe and it's gonna break soon. I felt really bad. My heart broke for him. It was sad. We're in Otaro Pilbeka Drive and we are here with the broken tree, oh, yeah, tree tower thing. Why didn't you think about it when you pulled down? Sad because he took for ages to build it and all of, and all of us thought it was cool. What do you think the kids think about it? Well, I was sad. I think some of the other kids were, were sad too that they destroyed it. Well, well you know, you don't, you don't just want a boring neighborhood, like you want something new. And I think that's like what kind of brought the street to life. Everybody was always running around looking at the treehouse. And now it's just, oh wow, everybody's gonna have to like go find somewhere else to look at or hang out at, so yeah. So that's it. The Tower of Autoda is no more. This neighborhood has to find something else to make it even better. This is Kaz reporting for Kid Kids News. to New Zealand on air.